Hello lovely people and welcome you once again to Bright and Clarice channel. Thank you all for clicking. This is episode 19 on the project for Mr. Stephen and Esther. This project is located at Elmina, K-E-E-A. Alright, so let's dive into the video. So in your view, it's a beautiful house. It was designed by the firm of Mr. Frank Hammond. Mr. Frank Hammond is an electrical engineer. Okay, he is an electrical engineer. That he deals in American 110, 220 wiring systems. If you want the British standard wiring, he will give that to you. Um, if he deals in air condition, cassette recessed, split air condition, ducting air conditions. Okay, um, he deals in solar systems as well. Okay, if you need a solar system, complete wiring, smart home wiring systems, he will do all of that for you. So please do not hesitate to contact him. He has a firm and they deal with structural engineering. So if you have Mr. Hammond, it's a complete package that you're carrying. All right. Okay, so in your view, is a total cost for the project. Apparently, we finished with foundation, we moved on to superstructure, and then we moved on to decking, and now we are at the first floor um, superstructure, and that is what we are working on right now. So pretty soon, we're going to be heading to the final works, which is the roofing, and hooray! <laughs> finally, oh, finally. <laughs> I can't wait to get there, you know. That would be my greatest achievement upon coming to the YouTube space, okay? Yes, I've been able to help a sister out there build her dream house. Um, I'm not a family member. She doesn't know me from anywhere. But right from here, we have bonded. She's just like my own sister, okay? Yes, and I will do anything for her. I will do anything for my sister, honestly. So that's how my blood is. I do things as though it is mine. I take passion in what I do. This house, I built it as though it was my own house. And so if I find any problem somewhere, man, I don't spare my artisans. I don't spare them at all. Yes, I don't spare them because I am the eye of my sister. And whatever that is good for me should be good for her. And I don't want to do anything that she will come home one day and feel disappointed. I want to make sure that by the time she gets home, she will definitely be excited. What she had imagined it will be the same. You understand? So the continuation pillar is done. As you can see, I still bend out. Everybody is on deck. We're doing everything as much as possible. I'm using one customer for the blocks. Different people, different blocks, different mindset. You understand? So one person he does supply our blocks and his blocks are really good the blocks are really good very strong and heavy you understand yes so continuation pillar is done so once we lay our blocks demarcate all the rooms we're going to cast all the pillars and then we'll move on to lintel once we're done with lintel we have to again continue because we want to achieve a certain height in the room it should be around three or 3.1 meters and then we're going to start with our rain gutters. Okay, we're going to do our rain gutters. And then we are done. And then the roofing or the wood trusses will be laid on top. And we are ready for roofing sheets. Okay. And once that is put on top, man, I will definitely find somebody to live in the house. <laughs> and we're going to start working on the house one by one, one by one. Because that part in terms of electrical works, plumbing works, okay, all those layouts done. Once we are done with all those layouts, then we're going to start with plastering. Plastering doesn't cost that much except the cement. Once we're able to get our sand, we have water, we add a little bit of chemical, we are good to go. We get cement about maybe 200 bucks, put it down. And start the plastering you understand yes we get about four trip of sand ready and we start our plastering and we're gonna plaster both inside and outside take our time get the level make sure it is straight 
once we are done with that then we start looking for our door frames okay door frames will come we'll fix all our door frames the main entrances will probably be a blood proof doors once you're able to secure those ones sometimes if those blood proof doors i want them to be last because sometimes if they come early you know these artisans they are so filthy obey anything to see her obey anything who fat for the children who said they are not obey anything so we will, we will find other alternatives so that we can do all our piping ways because wiring is something i want to do last these days when you do your wiring they will find a way of coming to steal it i don't know if this time they they connive with the people staying in the house so i don't even know so so before we do our wiring i have to make sure security is so tight yeah i have to ensure maximum security maybe get our fencing done or something someone is living in the house 24 7 and that way i can get the wiring done because i wouldn't want my sisters to suffer the losses that i went through because i did my wiring they stole everything i have to redo the wiring i put my ac air conditioning pipe they stole it i have to redo it i don't want her to go through that it's a loss it's a lot of losses so we'll be very strategic when we're getting there so those are some of the breakdowns that i give to encourage someone out there if you're out there it's a systematic approach to everything okay um you might have people who want to help you genuinely make sure they help you in the right way if you don't have anybody we are here we're going to be your family i'm here to help you okay that is all i don't pose everything on anybody no yeah, I know there are good people out there as well, equally as good as myself. So reach out to them, make sure they help you genuinely, and so you can also reward them. You understand? Yes. Remember, we say Chin Yedin too much. Be very flexible and be open minded, but be very critical. Ask questions, okay? Don't act as if you don't know anything. Ask questions. Simple, simple questions that demand answers. You understand? Very, very necessary. For me, I like people who ask questions because they are necessary. Are you with me? Very, very necessary. So if you're out there, you need help, we are here. If you have people genuinely who can assist you, please do so. Okay? Yes. And then I believe that by the time you realize your dream home will be done, will be completed. This place, the, Mr. Hammond, they designed this house. The rooms are so big, very spacious very very spacious you understand very spacious and i like the, the the design at the top it's so big if you go to the ground floor the hall the foyer the kitchen even the visitor's room is huge you understand the visitor's room is huge so I'm, I'm happy for my sister i'm happy for my sister and the husband and hopefully as i've indicated by next year by this time you will see a lot from this house you will see a whole lot okay so we're going to lay the blocks to about 12 courses the maximum we can go about 10 and then we'll bring our lintel after the lintel we're going to go about four courses more and after the four courses we're going to cast those pillars okay and then we start coming up with our rain garters we have to do another carpentry work at the top to get our polytan stands where the air conditions are going to be um where we're going to position our water heater okay your solar water heater all of that's going to be designed and then we're going to cast that concrete and once that is done another blog work will come to shaping it up so that nobody can see the poly tank are you with me once we are done that's it then we go to the coping they are coping at the edges we're going to do all the coping and once we are done with the coping then we have to start dressing the inside the gutters we have to do plastering okay from the inside all of that is a process are you with me it's a process and when you get to that stage i have to prepare another set of estimate for that particular one plastering both inside and outside ground floor first floor both inside and outside then roofing plastering and dressing of the coping are you with me yes then the roofing sheets will come man it's a journey, but I can't wait to fulfill and be part of that journey. Okay. If you like the video,
please give it a thumbs up please subscribe to the channel okay that is where some of us are able to generate a little bit of revenue so don't deny us that revenue and also the main purpose is to educate to open the eyes of other people and for you to even learn are you with me yes there are some artisans they are too archaic let them be exposed exposure is very very important my email is bright and clara at outlook.com my name is mr bright i am the ceo of bnc construction okay from me to you shalom god bless you wherever you are bye bye